Hello and welcome back to Fallout 4, Vats Only. I'm Super Twonky, and last time we managed to set up Mercer Safe House successfully, and we did the the DIA cache mission. So Ballistic Weave is now unlocked. Now it's only a matter of getting my strength stat up to 3, and then getting the armorer perk. My plan, in order to kind of conserve resources, is to get to level 25, and that way, when I apply Ballistic Weave, I'll have it at Mark 4, I believe. And I haven't really done this on previous episodes, so I figured it might be good to just kind of go over my special stats and my perks. So we have Strength at 2, Perception we have up to 10, Endurance at 1, as the rules state it has to stay, Charisma at 3, Intelligence 2, Agility 7, and Luck 7. The bobbleheads I still plan on getting that are gonna be important for perks are Strength, Agility, and Luck primarily. And as far as perks I already have, we've got Penetrator, Concentrated Fire, Rank 2 of Lone Wanderer, Rank 2 of Gunslinger, Rank 3 of Sneak, Rank 2 of Action Boy, Rank 2 of Idiot Savant, Rank 2 of Better Criticals, and Rank 2 of Critical Banker. And what I think we're going to start off by doing today is let's go to Good Neighbor, and I want to check Cleo's shop to see if she has any laser guns okay, with some good parts on them. So we're almost level 20, I feel like. We should start seeing those spawn soon. We've already had an advanced 10mm drop, so hopefully we're gonna start seeing some weapons with good mods on them. Also, I think it's hilarious that you can do this. And then just not get into any trouble. <laughs> like he didn't even confront me. But Hancock's gonna be totally cool with it. Oh, I like you. Walk into a new place, make a show. Wow. Friends. Hello. Nice. Good neighbors of the people. Sure. For the people. Take a look. You feel me? Everyone's in case welcome. Of boredom. And unfortunately, Cleo does not have a laser gun with a boosted photon agitator. Just a normal photon agitator, and I don't think that gives me a critical bonus over what I currently have. Plus, she does sell a shipment of ballistic fiber, so I should probably just go ahead and buy that. I think since the path is pretty clear for the most part, maybe we just go to Diamond City first just to double check. I really would like to have the better receiver on that Righteous Authority. Alright, so I haven't taken out these raiders. Let me just go ahead and just take down this machine gun turret. Very good. There should be like a raider over here. Shit's got ambushed. Nothing there now. What the? Oh, you're upstairs. Is that actually 93%? Guess so. Then I wonder if we can get the raiders down here too. There's kind of a bus in the way. And that's a 95. Except not really. <laughs> I hate that. We'll see if they come around the corner. I think I'm going back to hidden though. The hell? What they do to her? All right, let's just crit. You two. Oh, he's still alive. Well, maybe penetrator will actually work, or maybe not. It does still seem to be building up the crit meter, so I'll take it. Yeah, I mean, I've got, I've got my criticals back, so that works for me, I guess. 
And why not? Let's take out these ghouls as well. If they're gonna show up, that is. There's one. Building more critical meter with the Righteous Authority. Ah, oh, there's the other one. Wait. No, come back. On Earth? There you go. Alright. Nothing from Arturo either, Plenty unfortunately. Since I'm here, I'm gonna go down to Angman's Alley, and I do think I need to grab some fusion cells from the workbench there. Is that a t that's a raider, isn't it? Yep. So I'll grab some fusion cells from the workbench. And maybe I'll sleep for a couple days to reset his shock, just to uh, just to see if I can get a nice laser weapon from him. Well, maybe it's still too early for finding boosted photon agitators, because I didn't find one that time either. Let's just go. I did have a savant trigger on a couple of the locations near Boston Common, so I am pretty close to level 20. I think we'll find something to kill on the way to Mass Fusion to get to level 20 and then I can get the third rank of Gunslinger. Should help when uh, dealing with the gunners at Mass Fusion. In fact, there's a raider up here we can kill. And then this might give us a good vantage point. Seems solid. Alright, it's foggy out, but can we target any of these guys? Or are they too far away or behind cover? Oh, uh, there we go. Let's get a headshot critical. And idiot savant trigger. Very nice. That's uh, rank, rank three of gunslinger, baby. Alright, oh, I couldn't really seem to target any of the others at the moment, so we'll just head on down. Uh, too foggy to see the uh, spaceship, but I did get yet another idiot savant trigger from discovering this building. Oh, there is a raider. Right there. Okay. Sounds like... It's either Raiders really close by or it's Art and Art. I thought I heard it. Oh no. That is a Raider. Wait, it's art and art and raiders. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Wow, tough dude. Just set off a mine and kept walking like he didn't even care. All right, let's do mass fusion. Oh boy. Oh yeah. And yeah, you can go down too. Still in caution. Let's 
It's good to save you over here. Hang on. Are these turrets active? Can I just take it out? I have uh, I've never had an issue with these turrets before. This is this is this might be a first for me that I've had to take out these turrets when coming to mass fusion before the Brotherhood are even around. That's wild. So now I'm gonna maybe wait down here and see if I can pick off any patrolling gunners. We should see some showing up. There's one. Line up all the headshots. But we only need the first one. I think there's another gunner. There's one right there. Maybe we just crit. I do need to save some criticals for the one that has the missile launcher, though. What? Yeah, gotta love that. They set off their own trap, and then that puts them in caution. It's so dumb. That guy's taken out. Maybe we can go back down to hidden, hopefully. There we go. Oh, someone else up here. Yeah, I saw you. Not sure if this is a missile launcher person. Let's just let, uh, some, do some body shots. Nope. No missile launcher on them. Missile launcher gunner has got to be this one. Let's see if I can get a critical, maybe a couple criticals. One more. There we go. That's the power of going into third person and then using penetrator. <laughs> And I'm gonna hope I can build up criticals on the gunners up ahead to take down the guy that has the power armor. There we go. Can I carry that? No. No, I cannot. Anyone I can see across the way from here? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, there's somebody. Got him taken out. I'm gonna go down here, I think, because they like to go through that door and check the corner. There's also, oh, that's a legendary. Also this guy. There we go. you. And another gunner over there. We'll just stick behind cover. And they don't seem to be coming after me per that aggressively. Yeah, we're already back into caution. Um, uh, man, I'm, I'm actually building up grits pretty quick. Uh, 
This is the basic gunner, let's just get torso shots on him. Not too bad. It could have gone smoother, admittedly, but I did manage to take him out without getting hit. And let's see what this legendary had. Mutant Slayers. Not really what I'm looking for. Alright, so I already have full crits. What? Whoa. Hang on. Is this actually gonna work? There's no way this is gonna work, is it? Mm. It is gonna work. Alright, you can just shoot through the bottom of the window, I guess. That seems great. <laughs> okay, now this guy. This could be... This could be bad. I think we need to get the fusion core. We need to just land... Like, three criticals on it. And hope for the best. That didn't seem to do very much. Oh well. Oh boy, he's coming right for me. Did we get it? Yikes. Alright. So his power armor exploded, but we're still in danger. Which I think means he's still alive. But where is he? Can I get back? Okay, I'm back into caution. Doesn't seem to be chasing me. No, I hear him. Just playing a little game of hide and seek. Oh, there he is up there. Alright. I'm gonna hope to get back into hidden and get a, get a sneak attack on him. And I believe I do have a crit. I can hear him. I don't have a visual. I'm guessing he's directly above me. I'm just gonna assume he went back to his kind of default starting place. Yep, there he is. Oh, he's almost dead. Guess that would make sense since, you know, his fusion core exploded. Alright, strength bobblehead. And this actually has... I guess it has a reflex sight and a beam focuser. I don't think I have either of those parts, so I, I'll go ahead and take that. Well, mission successful. Let's head out. So, what do we do now? I think maybe we do a little work for the Minutemen. Maybe we clear up Corvega. Lots of raiders there that we can take down and get more XP. Well, let's go ahead and put the reflex sight on the righteous authority and the beam focuser. Wow, look at the range on this thing. It's crazy. So, I noticed that this one has an overcharged capacitor. I think I think I want to just go ahead and use that. It doesn't have a critical multiplier, but its base damage is so much higher than the photon exciter, which is what I'm currently using, that I think we're just going to do that. <laughs> oh, it has a fine-tuned beam focuser? Okay. Yeah, that has some very nice mods on it. We'll go ahead and do overcharge capacitor. Eventually, I would like to use the boosted photon agitator instead. Wow. And just like that, Righteous Authority has, like, some top-tier mods on it. Okay, well, let's head up north. Okay, Cor Vega with uh, some of the upgrades on this Righteous Authority. I wonder how far away we can snipe these guys from. Can't get them from here, it doesn't seem like. So maybe we go to the overpass? Ah, we can get this guy. There we go. 
Someone way up there, but I can't target him in vats. There's a turret. And we just take this thing down too. Go. Concentrated fire going to work. And is that gonna get some raiders coming after me? Here we go. Come on. Let's just take these guys out. Alright, I'm gonna... Maybe let's just go up on the overpass and see if I can snipe them. I really don't want this to take too much time. Feral Ghoul over there as well. But if we get up here, yeah, we can get some of the ones that are, like, up on the roof. Oh, here we go. Boop, boop. And a boop, boop, boop. And you over there. Yeah. Another idiot savant trigger. And... Why not? To crit that guy too. We build up critical meter so quickly. That I might as well use them. And yeah, this guy's gonna be fairly easy to hit, so we can build a meter off of him. Or a little amount, since that was, you know, a one shot. Um There we go. Crit that guy, and we are in hidden. Ooh. My goodness. <laughs> wow. This gun is... It was already good. I'm gonna go ahead and say right now it feels pretty insane. Although these are low-level raiders. Oh. Wait, can we get concentrated fire? Help land hit. <laughs> yep. Awesome. And I do have a critical now. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. And I don't know if I've taken out all the raiders over here or not. I feel like there's one or two more patrolling up here usually. But let's find out. Like, the, I think there's... Maybe it's just the two in here. Let's see if we can take them out quickly. <laughs> oh, 95 headshot. Yeah, let's do that. Alright. Raider across the way. And yeah, the outside I feel like is almost totally clear. But I have a feeling like we're about to be seen, or no, we're about to see someone else. And we're still in hidden. So, I don't know if it's within the rules for me to hit these things. Um, I'm, I don't, I'm not really sure. I feel like I should be able to. They're not enemies. But at the same time, I would be firing my weapon without using vats. And I know that it just kind of feels like that could be against the rules. 
Um, I don't know, let me know what you think. I think for now, just to be safe, I'll refrain from firing upon the uh, searchlights. And just because it feels weird to leave a bobblehead behind, we'll go and grab the repair bobblehead. Yes. And I like to enter Corvega, the interior, from this hatch over here. I don't know if there are other entrances that offer a bigger strategic advantage, but for me personally, this is just the one I'm the most comfortable with. All right. Well, we are already noticed. I guess there's a bunch of searchlights in here. And after what I just said, I guess I probably shouldn't... Probably shouldn't uh, shoot them. That'll make things interesting. I was gonna switch to the Deliverer, but maybe I'll just stick with this gun. Since my cover's blown anyway. There we go. Yeah, we'll just we'll just take all of you out. <laughs> Alarms just going off everywhere. I'm still in danger, but there's no one else on this side of the room. That's it. Here we go. Back up to full criticals. And you know what? Let's get a little bit more max HP Come on, I dare you. from some blood bug steak. Huh? You be. And we'll see if any of the raiders over here decide to show up. Only a fucking coward hides. Raider scum. Should I use a? Should I burn a crit on this guy? Probably. It seems. Like it was sketchy at best, even though the percentages were high. Oh, we got this guy down here. Got him. A few more. Is that gonna work? Yep. Come on. Why can't I target the other guy? Ooh. Well, we leveled up. So, I have five perk points until level 25. Three of them have to be armor. But for now, yeah, none of these I can really spend points on. So Sneak is going to be level 23. Yeah, well, let's just go with armor. Something tells me this is not going to hit. Yeah, it was 95, but didn't hit. Let's burn a crit on it. Oh. Do I want to use two crits on it? That seems... bad. Maybe this will work? Okay, that worked. Come on out! I'll make it nice and quick. You can trust me. Well, let's just head down and see what happens. I thought there would be more raiders coming. Oh, are they coming? Yep. Eh, 95. I'll take it. Anymore? Yep, I see you. Just used a crit since he was, like, getting right behind that pipe. I don't think there's gonna be any more coming in here. I think there's only three that come over from that door. Nice. Oh, man, come back. I was having fun. No 
Sweet. Back into hidden. There's also a ton of aluminum around here in these coolant caps. I don't do as much crafting on this run as others, but at the same time, I can't just leave these behind. I mean, it's aluminum. Okay, there should be, what, three or four raiders over here? Let's take these guys out as well. And we're kind of in, in stealth now, so let's switch to the deliverer. See if any more show up. Oh, ah, too fast. Wait, there. Come on, show yourself. They go past that window too quickly. I think I'm just going to end up going back down into Hidden. There we go. Got a nice clean shot on him. Don't you die on me! This guy seemed to notice. Wherever he is. No one in this room? Oh, I am picking up too much stuff, as usual. Get him through the window. Oh yeah. Let's go ahead and disarm that. I don't think there's another one. Yeah, I think there's only three. Down here? Cool. Let's keep on going. Nice. This room over here. Got you. Oh. Well, fine then. Maybe the Righteous Authority would have been better. Alright, it's doing that thing where it like builds crit meter but doesn't actually hit the th target, so I'll just use another critical on that. And... Yeah, we'll take out this Raider with the Righteous Authority. Two raiders. And we'll get the ghouls to show up as well. Come on out, ghouls. No raiders left up here. I think these were the three that kind of leave. Yeah, they kind of they go up through the door into that room. Wow, Fury. Don't see that every day. Let's head down here, deal with the turret and the ghouls. Build up some more critical and get some more XP. Yeah. 
mod. I know there's ghouls in here. You know you're here. Just come on out. There you are. Wow, a very mentats too. Oh my goodness. Got it. Well, that just leaves the final room in this building. With a Jared. Our main target. and take that out and we can at least target one raider I think I'll back up a little bit I believe there is oil on the ground so someone could ignite that it in now This thing's going to be really annoying. I wonder if I can kill it. Thank you, Penetrator. Raider over there. Got him. Still unhidden somehow. That's surprising. Go ahead and get this turret. How has no one noticed? It's really weird. Like, this is not a silenced weapon. It's a loud weapon. And I'm killing turrets and raiders pretty close to him. What's up, Jared? I think we've got one more raider here. I think it's the guy that was... yeah. The guy up there. Let's just do another crit. And I will go ahead and loot the stuff up here, even though it does spawn more raiders. I don't think I am too scared of them. Grab the Grognak magazine. Welcome to the party. Was it just two of them? I thought three showed up for some reason. Well, hey, that works for me. Let's do some looting, and then we can... Uh, probably just be done for the day. Alright, well. That was Corvega totally cleared. And I don't think I got hit once. So, yeah, this... This Vats only build is... Really starting to come together. And even though these are low-level raiders... I'm, uh, I'm starting to see the power of pure Vats. So, yeah, we'll end that here. Next time, we'll go ahead and turn in this mission and probably just talk to Preston again because we yeah we want to get to level 25 for armor but yeah until then I appreciate you watching and I'll catch you next time have a good one bye